Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you are all doing well today. So today we are going to work on our CW Planner by Marguerite Miller. And this is week 22. There we go. Okay, so this week's prompt is a date. So I have this stamp here. So we're going to use it for the date. Um, I also have... What else did I have? Oh, yeah, for the date. This little piece from um, a vintage um, calendar, if you will. So it's got dates, and this is 1971, my birth year. And then we have a flag. So I found this card, and I really like this, and it's got the flag on it. So I thought we would use that. But then I also have a stamp with the U.S. flag on it. This was $0.08. Cents. I'm not sure what year it was from. But yeah, we have that. And then we have something found underwater. So here I have, I guess these are beavers. So here we have this picture. We're going to have to cut it down a little bit. Um, let's go ahead and mark about where we will tear this down. I'm going to tear down some on this side too so that we can use the tear roller. Give it kind of that torn look. So something found underwater. I also have these stamps which is, this is from Korea, but this is a frog. It's found underwater. And then this is from uh, New Guinea, and it's a crab. So it's also found underwater. So I thought those would be cute to add to our underwater. Uh, then we have a ribbon. So I have this piece of ribbon here. We will possibly figure out how to do something with. I can't make a bow, so that's definitely not going to be a bow. Um, a group of threes. So I have these three flowers that I thought was really pretty. So that's a group of three. And I also have these three bows. So that's a group of three. So we have that covered. Um, and then our bonus is something with a bumpy surface. And this right here was from um, Rachel over at Roxy Creations. So I thought maybe we could cut this out. This is a bumpy surface where it has the uh, stitching on there. I'm trying to figure out what I think it goes this way. Or maybe it goes this way. I think it goes this way. Oh, for the love of the Lord. I have no idea. Okay. So we shall go ahead and get started. Um, so I think this we're going to go ahead and do that. I think I'm also going to go ahead and just cut this edge. Oh, maybe I should slide my chair oh, like a thousand miles away from my crafting table. Yeah, we will go ahead and cut this white off here. All the way around it. I hope you're all having a good day today. I am filming crazy today because it's what I want to do. I want to craft and I want to bring my friends along with me. It is uh, Sunday, actually, May 16th. I know, guys, when I'm filming this. Uh, and it is my birthday, so that's what I wanted to do this morning. Got up a little after... 4 a.m. I believe and have done about three or four videos and downloaded one video so yeah just having a really good time doing what I love this morning yeah I think that'll be okay right there but you know what I think I'm gonna cut this down because I really like this right here and we can use that on a something else on a something else look at that isn't that cute yeah we'll save that all right so we can have that there and then we can put this up here and then maybe do that that way maybe um let's see this guys we'll go ahead and like cut around this because we're not going to be able to fit the whole thing on there anyway. So we will just cut out the bumpy part since that's what we need for this project. And see where we can fit it on here. Alright, let's see. We can save that piece. How 
how about like that, guys? I think that'll be okay over there. Cut it a little bit straighter so we can get it to the edge. We still have our week 22 up there. We almost have our notes down here, so I think I'm going to just do that. Here we go. We can still be a little bit more off of here. Oh, that'll be cute. Is that the right way? Or is this the right way? What's the right way? Well, does anyone else struggle with this? Well, it's going to go that way, whether it's right or wrong or whatever. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Okay, so we have our mark. Get it together, Lori. You have your mark already. And let's get out the tear ruler. And we will go ahead and tear this down about here. Let's see if we can try to keep it straightish. And then I want to tear a little off the top. A little off this side. And a little off the bottom. That way it's kind of got that, oh well, tiered look all the way around it. Alrighty. So then this will go here. You can actually probably put that there. Nope, I don't like that. We'll put it there. Okay, so then we have we have our little stamps here. Maybe they could go there. We have our other stamp for our flag. And have our groups of three that may look cute there and do we want to use our bows because I mean we don't have to but I think they may be cute if we just did them like right across there that look cute See, I have no idea which way these bows go. I think maybe we'll do our bows across there. Oh, we got our ribbon. What are we doing with our ribbon? Okay, let's see. See if we can make... Well, maybe we could just do it like that. Ouch. Cut myself with the scissors. Save that other piece. And, yep, not good with ribbons. Turn it back this way. Mm. Maybe we'll take that out since we have our stamp. Let's get a stamp somewhere. Maybe we'll just do this here somehow. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. Okay, so since we have this material, let's just go ahead and use this. Here. Hopefully, hopefully we can get it to stay down there. So there is one group of three. It's not going to stick. Okay. Now maybe. 
maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I don't know how I got that glob on there. Just to a little bit down through there. Just got it all over my mat, which is typical. There we go. That is bumpy. Let's get something in that corner there. There we go. Now let's get out this and put Mr. Frog down. Right here. And then Mr. Krabby Crab from New Guinea. In there. Alright, so we got that page. So, I guess we will start with this on the bottom. And of course, I don't have my glue book ready. I got glue boogers all over my fingers. All right, so let's get our. What did I say they were? Beavers. Let's get our beavers down, guys. Okay, Mr. Beavers. There you go. And then we will get our flag down. Then we can work with the other. this back out and see if we can get these little bows down right across here be another group of threes These are cute. Guess I need to give it a minute, don't I, guys? A little impatient here. Alright. And then our green. Those are cute. These I had just gotten in. I got them off of Amazon. And I think I've only used one once. So. That's cute. Okay. I like that. Now this thing guys. I am. Not sure about this. Why don't we. Because that, that glue is going to come right through there. Um. Why don't we use a piece of washi tape, maybe? To tape it across the middle. Maybe. Haha. <laughs> hey guys, that works for me. Yep. It surely does. Now we have this. 
Maybe we could do this as like a flip for no particular reason. So let's do the art glitter glue here. Then it like flips up. Cute. For no particular reason at all. Alright. And now we needed our um, a date. So. Um, figure out where I had that. Get our lids back on everything. Because now we're going to be stamping. Done with all this mess. Alrighty, so I think those are cute. Let's see. Um, that. There we go. Just do it in different places. How about that? This is May 16, 1964. I have no idea why. <laughs> A little crazy with the stamping, but... Oh, no. Okay. That didn't go well. Because that is a slick surface. How about down here? That was a little slick, too. Okay, I guess that's enough of that, huh, guys? Alright. Okay. Alright, guys. That is going to do it for this week's... I think it's cute. I like it. This week's CW Planner. So we have a date. Of course, we got the date all over. It's May 16th, 1964. Uh, a group of threes. We have our flowers here. And then we have our three bows there. Uh, a flag. So we have our American flag here and here. And this, again, is a little flip up. Again, don't ask me why. Um, a ribbon. So we have our poor little ribbon here. I knew what not to do with. And something with a bumpy surface. We have this embroidery here. And again, that's from Rachel over at Roxy Creations. All right, guys. Thank you all so much for coming along with me. Uh, I appreciate you guys. Please give me a thumbs up, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.